got Snake, my main. Love me some Snake. Uh, I'm curious to see what this matchup looks like at a high level. Uh, but yeah, let's learn. Oh, it's Ocelot. That is a fire Snake name. Yeah. An actual MGS name. That's that's fire. Yeah. Riveting so far. All right. So we, <laughs> we see. I mean, look. C4 snake in the middle. <laughs> oh, no. Probably anyway, bud. The, the, the tech in place. Avoiding it. I so. feel like Chakram could actually cut out a lot of uh, what he wants. Like, him cooking grenades is going to be a lot less useful. Uh, him approaching with dash attack is a little bit more committal now with that. Oh, wow. That's a crazy gamble at a disadvantage from Eric. But it's good to keep your opponent guessing. Oh, Tornado. Tornado is so underrated, dude. I think that projectile on any other character would be and it's good on Sword Fighter, but that projectile on like Politan or something, oh my god, nightmare fuel. You know what I mean? Yeah. What is that angle? That has so much momentum. I have never seen that move carry somebody like that. Excuse me? My god, it was like he got flooded. It was it literally might as well have been flooded. That was insane. <laughs> that man got that man got game sharks, man. <laughs> he did. That's wild. Like I that angle was insane. It was crazy. And now Eric is just like, yeah. I planned it. Right. It was all according to plan. I knew it was going to send you there. That's why I picked this character. You know what Ocelot's going to do for the rest of the set? Respect his recovery. Yeah. You can't. You have to be like, well, I guess I could die if I'm wrong. Nice. Or you can get comboed. Ooh. You can get comboed back to stage as well. Lay down. Mm. Yeah, good effort. Trying to find a roll read situation. Uh, he was looking for an up tilt, which definitely could have killed by now. Ocelot's got to be careful. Yeah, get rid of that C4. That C4 was almost ready to detonate. We already saw him get hit by his own C4 when it timed out earlier. We don't need that twice. I like the attempt, but Eric is uh, pretty patient with playing a nice grounded game, pressuring Ocelot with uh, Chakram and Tornado, and just kind of like looking for moments to sneak his way in. Ocelot. Ooh, Ocelot firing back with that uptilt, all right? The, the great equalizer, the uptilt. Yes. The boots. Size 15 steel toes, you know? You gotta do that. Right. You need all that. Man, Ooh, really, really works the, the forward tilt one, not gonna be, not gonna want to commit though, but the full commitment right there. 34%. Uh, oh, he's fine. Okay. Or not. Hey, um, it's too early for what is it? It's not noon, is it? Yeah, it's, it's too ten, early for spaghetti. You know what? It's 10:43 a.m. You know, some people are still getting adjusted to the time difference. Myself included. I get it. I get it. But uh, yeah, that was a really shocking SD from Eric there. There it is. And here's another thing too. I think Swordfighter's actual advantage state is pretty solid. They yeah. have a decent amount of combos. And Snake is definitely a character that can get bullied if you're not careful. Yeah, I mean, at 103, I think Tornado confirmed definitely going to do some damage here. Oh, yeah, starting tornado, now. Honestly. Tornado confirm or down throw in the up air. Now, I like that Ocelot is trying really hard to get out of the way of the Tornado. I think maybe if he... And this is easier said than done because I do this exact... I have the same problem. No way! That was that strong? You got hit by a discus and you just died? He reflected the grenade. So, like, I get that the knockback was increased, but Snake is a relatively heavy man. I cannot believe that reflect was that strong. This man is, this man is distraught. He can't believe it. He's like, bro, why did I, why did I get under the stage like that? Also that. Why am I dying the grenade like this? Yeah, what a, what a start to the set. You get flooded by a character that doesn't have a water hose to death for the first stop. And then you die to your own grenade. I, I can't believe how strong that was. That was, that was wild. That was a wild kill. I ain't gonna lie. I but then just the, but then just the constant SDs to get into a one stock situation and then and then dying like that and this man this man and you bosses, can see it in the camera this man like, boss is like bro like, why like, like bro I was on the stage what's what's up I was at a hundred like it's, it's just a grenade why is this happening to me I don't get it do that much like but uh oh and on the smaller stage me sword fighter Ocelot you might want to call Snake. See if you can get Otacon's phone number because oh yeah you might need some backup for yeah, this yeah you gotta call a lifeline dog. Nice. The combos. Yeah. Seventy-eight percent from zero. That was really good. Fully taking advantage of the platform placement. The me, of SBF. the me sword fighter standard. Give me some more. Uh, yep, I like the idea of the tornado confirmed trying to finish off. Uh -huh. Oh, the slow chakram. Really smart. Yeah. So with tornado and chakram, you really can't cook grenades that much in neutral here. And that is such a core part of like Snake's game plan that Ocelot's gonna have to work around. Nice up air. Oh, I thought we were going for the up air right nah, there. He, 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 there's not. I feel like there might not be enough damage set up. He probably wants to get up there to confirm off that. But taking the UAV way, way up and a little help from Eric will send him into the blast zone. All right. Speaking of great equalizers, Nikita universally busted edge guarding tool here. As, as long as he cancels it on the multi-hits, it looks like he can kind of just rinse and repeat that for free. But Eric found his way back. That gets reflected. You've got to be careful. 
this is like a very good like anti snake move set actually. Like you got the reflect, you got two different projectiles that stop you from camping from your projectiles. This is really really good positioning. This is a really good position for Eric to be in. It. Generally. Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't know like uh, if you really want to start cooking grenades like that when that reflect if the grenade is what killed you like that last exactly. game. Exactly. I don't know if you want to keep cooking them like that. Up air? Up air, yeah. hey, as I live and breathe, the combo confirmed, don't lie. Eric, gonna be up three stocks to one. That's also one of those things where, like I don't know for sure if down throw to up air is true, but it always feels true. But I just don't have enough like experience against this character to know. But that's definitely scary. Nice. All right. Eric was a little bit too far to one side trying to get that reflect on that up smash. I will say this. The reflective snake up smash, you thought that grenade was bad? That is so much stronger. Got to be really careful. Good positioning. You know, he's got the platform covered. He's got the ledge covered now with the grenade. Like, um, if nothing else, you can, when you have a character that has a reflect and you know they're trying to abuse it against you, you can kind of condition them against it. You can kind of, like, bake them into going for it and punish accordingly. Easier said than done. But, um... And it worked for that first stock, but either way, Ocelot just has a lot of work to do to make it back into this, uh, make it back into the set. Go a little down B and yeah, and Eric is perfectly comfortable just kind of camping in the corner, yeah, throwing out these projectiles. Like he's making Snake like physically kind of force his way in, and he's not the worst at that because of dash attack. But there's definitely characters that are a lot stronger in that department. Yeah, I got the uh, I got the stock lead, so there's really no need for me to like make an over commitment to you. Oh at yeah, all. I'm gonna be all right. Will no, you be all right? Are you are you gonna how long are you gonna avoid these tornadoes? Because that's probably what you're looking for. Nice. Oh my god! I still bro. don't know why that one killed earlier. Cause look at that, that was reflected. No one even close to that knockback. Nice. Okay. All right. Got the Nikita coming through. And he he did slow it down to try to bait the reflect, but he didn't get a big punish for it. This is what sucks for Ocelot right now. He can get confirmed to death from either his projectiles or Eric's projectiles. If any of them hit him, he can set up for he can set up for a kill. Wow. Wow. I'm going for the up tilt right there. Very, very well done. So that's a very privileged leg right there, my lord. So Ocelot still has an opportunity here. If he can continue to slow play, if he can continue to slow play and just acquire some like big damage, maybe a read can be on nice. the way. Like that. 31%. Yeah, he's got to go for something crazy. He's at C4. Oh, he floated with the uh, tornado a little bit. That could have been a lot of damage for Ocelot. But right now, Eric's back in the driver's seat. Good on Ocelot not to go into Cypher. Uh, I think most of these four fighters' uh, aerials will, like, kill him out of Cypher or definitely break Cypher. Nice dash attack. Yeah. Yeah. 